Hello listen guys, I'm Asa. If you're new to my channel, please subscribe. And don't forget to check out my playlist. They're amazing, remarkable, and worth watching. Okay, today we're gonna answer this. This is the and a linear relationships, horizontal and vertical lines. So I've learned said y equals mx, which is y example y equals 1x just this example form y equals 0x is just a straight line y equals 1x is a diagonal line like this y equals 2x is even steeper 3x so on and and 100x 1000x and after that just x after that x is infinite is x infinite y equals infinity x is actually the same as just x equals zero that that's exactly the same as it and it'll be so confusing if you don't know why it needs to be like this like just x on the graph is like that i don't know i don't know why <laughs> just so confused and today we're going to show this here this is the mesolithic oh my gosh look at this this is very awesome I know this is just the, one of the easiest problems. So oh my gosh, look at the animation one. moves. I want you to see this. This is the number one. I did it. I know it's eight there on the line graph. This is negative six there on the line graph. And now let's go to number three. Now it's x equals of course four. So now we enter again because it's just double check x again. no matter what so whenever it's an x line it goes in the y axis whenever it's a y line it goes like a x axis i just don't understand like it's like it's quite switch switched or something like this <laughs> i don't really know. you know the answer right yes i know the answer it's really awesome checks oh man gosh this is very awesome and did you see this? Later we'll have to screenshot for that. Oh, I was putting clay on my nails as a decoration right here. It's so funny. <laughs> see? It can just be easily removed like this. <laughs> I just like to do it because it's just like a decoration. You can see my clay over here. I made these different colors. Purple and magenta. You cannot see it because it looks so blackish. I know, I know, I know. You have to answer one of but the I'm so yeah, this, is, this is purple. This is magenta. You can see that the, those colors are actually also in Minecraft. So this, of so course, this is y equals three. Okay. Y, if y equals just a number, then it would just look like that. Huh? You would ask. You would say, huh, I did not know that. Okay. It's because y is equal to a straight line. So y equals x, uh, y, so y equals zero x, which is y just equals zero, or just y, that's, uh, that's equal to just y equals zero, which just equals a straight line like that. Hmm, confusing. And x equals zero like this. Confusing as well, but we would answer it. Three, two, three, three, two, one, and woohoo! Yay, I'm righty ups. Woo! I'm gonna take Woo! a picture. Sorry, it's okay. Can I go back to take a picture? Sorry, I will do that after the video. Later. Later, so yeah, it's right. I'm excited. Yeah, woo! Very exciting. You should know what's so there. So, this is x equals, of course, negative 1. So, here, x equals negative 1 like this. This is the line. And because I know, whenever it's a x, when it's just only one x equals like that, so a number, a certain number, uh, like that. So, it would look like this. I know that it's on the y axis, so it's x. So confusing. It's switched. Hmm, 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 hmm. So let's do this. And Tor Rec. So good. <laughs> I even said and Torek. Like enter and correct. <laughs> yeah, and Torek. 
Yeah, sounds like a winning stuff. Entorex sounds like a victory or something in some kind of game or something. Entorex sounds like that. <laughs> okay, right here. So here, yeah. so equation of slime. Oh wow. X equals negative nine. So is this X equals negative nine? Look at that sign. Oh. It's so red. And it's so far away from it. Okay, you can I see. But if you zoom out, you would see it's not that far. So here, three, two, one. Woohoo! Yay! Okay. This is pretty awesome. Look at this. Ten. Right, no, number eight. I mean, Look number at the cars. Yay! Yay! So there, equation, of course. X equals three. X equals three right here. X equals three. So X equals three. Okay, let's enter it. So enter, and it's just so easy. I can't okay, wait, believe I'll have it. To take a picture. Hmm. This is just so easy problems in a graph. Right. You can just do whatever you like. Sine cosine x of so one mm -hmm. dot dot dot. Just if you do x and a certain number okay, or something one, yes. like that. If you do it, then you would get crazy graphs. Like me, I got this kind of graph like this, 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 this. It hey, just goes like this, and like after it go like this and like this and so on. It just goes like that forever, and I'm just so confused about that. So, let's. Oops. Oh my gosh. <laughs> so yeah, this is what. what? I, I, I almost I saw I thought seven or something. So here, y equals eight. There, eight is actually my favorite number. You don't know that, of course, because my A number stuff lots of eights even in my A and logos. So yeah, you can see that. Number nine. So now. look at this. The car roll. Guap guap guap. Yups. <laughs> it's like it got struck by a tornado or something. So here, so. This is y equals 9, of course. So, we would enter. Woo! Enter it! Like, poof! The car got destroyed. Boom! 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 And I did an explosion with smoke. It's over there. All this work got gone. <laughs> wow. So, the other animation about hey, the car going into the roller ten. coaster, you try to see that. Try to see it in my other videos. The car, there's a different animation like the car going on a roller coaster instead of just poofing out. So here, it would be like this. Mm -hmm. The car would stay like this, and after that, it on the nice animation. This this part, that's what happened. And then on the fifth part, it just is looking like it's going on a roller coaster. And on the tenth animation, of course, it's going on a roller coaster. And this poof, it'll just gone. Mm -hmm. this so here. The equation of this line is, of course, x equals 8. I mean, negative 8. <laughs> x equals negative 8. So right here, it's on the negative 8, and this is x, because it just goes here. This is the x-axis, but x actually goes on the y-axis because it's switched. I just don't understand why that needs to be on the slopes, but it's just good. <laughs> yeah, 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 it makes it too confusing too sometimes. So let's enter the end. Correct! Oh my god, I have Oops. to get a picture. Yes, turn on it. Turn on it. Let's go, go! That's all? Wait, <laughs> <laughs> it was, it's it's a robot who destroyed it. It was not a tornado, it was a robot who destroyed it. Ah, okay. Oh my gosh, I was so too confused. Just, oh, the robot is the one who destroyed the car a while ago. Ah, yes. I see. Okay, please subscribe. Please subscribe to my channel and please click the like. Oh, and please check my playlist and please subscribe to my channel.